G'day, another drill, we're from Kiwi Bees, welcome back. Uh, this is our mains powered home brewed or salic vaporizer. Um, a couple of quick notes to people that want to make them themselves. Get an Alec chicken to wire it up. 240 volts through here. Um, if it's not earthed properly, you'll know about it, well, for a very short time. We've had a wee bit of a play with it and this one here runs better at 180. You can see I've been fiddling today and you see the crystals and it's sublimating on the outside and into a cloud which we should see shortly. So we'll cut the video and it takes a couple of minutes to warm up. It's at 86 now, I've only just plugged it in when it before I started work, we're talking. See it climbing up in temperature now. Cut the video and we'll get back to it. Yeah, she's up to temperature now and it's overrun. It's got up to 187, so 7 degrees over the top, which I don't think is too bad. My ringy made lids. Get out of the way. You see the stuff that dripped off onto Mum's new painted deck, sublimated. Mm. <laughs> I'm toast. And you can see crystals on top of the this uh, salic is a bit wet too and damp. You can see the crystals on the top of the. The idea is we have a row of these, I'll get some PPTFE lids made up. But this was just a project to see if it would work. You can see the salic in the bottom there still sublimating out. <laughs> she huffs and puffs away. Mum, can you please put this over So we're going to drill a hole in the front of the hives. Not too keen on the side. I think I'd much rather shoot it straight into the brood nest. Um, you can see this white mist. I think it's on my gimbal. Um, when it touches something a bit cooler, you sure will sublimate out. But so, yeah, quite happy with the way it's turned out. I'll whack this up on the beef site for the, all the home brewers to have a play with later on. As I said, she's just a quick and dirty prototype. Surprise, surprise, she works. <laughs> 